Hello and welcome to my part 7 of uh, Blind Playthrough of Vaporoom, an awesome indie dungeon crawler and steampunk setting made in Slovakia. In the last two episodes we went through the double level of uh, Riddle of Steel and the boiling point uh, where we had to finish up some pretty interesting riddles. Today we will just jump on the elevator and go to the level 7 and hopefully the riddles will stay as much challenging as so far. As you can see, we are level 10 and we are getting Taumaric, uh, full, completely full Taumaric build. And we have no cost chance for spells and max integrity restored after kills because I'm still a little bit rusty. And the next way how we go will be probably the elemental conductor at least this one point and we'll see how it goes so this is our equipment and our spells so, let's get inside. Creepy little things. This sounds like a trap. Hmm. Basic deco beacon. This might be a little bit more interesting for me than what I have so far. Let's see. I really am curious what will happen. Yep. Man, I hate spiders. Yep. This doesn't make any sense. All the systems in the machines, they're all hostile now. We made them to protect and support the people while they lived and worked here. There's no way this is some kind of simple malfunction. So, killing machines and getting back the 7% of the health helps and such swarmings. Good to know. We have better upgrade. Oh, let's put this as well. Fourteen. 
well. Let's go. I don't see any hidden buttons, so let's go this way. Hmm, cannot be moved a second time. Oh, pretty dark environment again. I don't like that. Okay. Doesn't work. So we will need to go this way. Okay, feeling a little bit rusty again in the morning. Uh, okay, let's hope this will get a little bit better down the level.
What has been opened? Oh. Long time no see. Hey buddy, I haven't seen you in a long time since they assigned me to the labs. Life is one big bore. The people here are different, so serious and reserved. Someone could have told me that dress code was funeral up here. Suits, cloaks, tights and bland looks. Something definitely going up on... getting going on on this floor. I can tell you that something just cannot quite find the words to best say it. See you in the canteen tomorrow. Jane Shane, Substance Field Assistance. James Kroll, deputy foreman of manufacturing. So, Captain Pistol. Looks like we need to get rid of this. Advanced, 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 basic, but we don't have any more. Well, cadet pistol and captain pistol. Good. Now, hidden buttons. Nope. But we need to get out of here somehow. I see. Okay. Oh. Let me check something first. Looks like clear. No hidden buttons here. Anything else? Looks like not. Should be all. Now it works. Okay. Time for a quick save.
Okay, the few bots are down and we can search a little bit for the for the hidden buttons. Oh, I wish this level was a little bit more bright. My monitor is a little bit behind. Let's see. Let's go this way. We have another pit. Rusty key in this place. This place, the main pipeline hub that brings Fumium to all other parts of the Arx. Can't believe I was once so proud of taming this stuff. So let's check it out and try to not fall into the pits. Is this a lever? Yes, but I can't get there. Okay, looks like that's it. We can't get anywhere further, so we need to get back here because only pits are now available, and I didn't find any any hidden buttons. So let's get back. Oh, sorry, I'm blind. There is definitely one more place to go room. Yeah, a little bit hard to not fall into the pits in this environment, so I rather take few hits. Well. Nothing. This one. Good.
We got another bit. Closed down. Fumium light. This is becoming almost laughable. We've just discovered yet another uses for fumium light. During motion in liquid form, it glows with this mesmerizing light blue color. I've been staring at it for days since the discovery, and I just can't get enough. Very pleasant on the eye. I have submitted a proposal to use fumium for lightning, as it's already everywhere in circulation anyway. That would save us a lot of running costs. Laura Reich was ecstatic about it. She said that the more ways we can put Fumium to work, the better. So I hope the proposal will go through and will be so much more beautiful out here afterwards. Zealot outfit. And looks like this is exactly an upgrade which I was searching for. No under. We were here, here. No hidden buttons. And this one is still... Oh! I missed you! Nice. The last chest. Shit. Still more. Is that it? Looks like I don't hear any more crawling. No buttons. A rusty key. Okay, let's throw away the Shield. Hmm, very big place and now secret. Well I will check that a little bit later probably. Let's go now back to the Start. And let's say uh, before moving forward. I'm a little worried about the current research. 
research projects we're undergoing. The Bureau is slow to analyze our output, and the documents we send out every month have still not been acknowledged or even given proper opponency. We haven't received authorization for the upcoming research schemes either. However, some teams continue to hammer away on their own initiative, and I have to curb the progress artificially. What's worse, more and more accidents are popping up around the research focused on Fumium. Is it because of the failure to comply with regulations, or because of the instability the substance is becoming known for? I don't know yet, and I want answers. And my more of my notes again. Uh, well, I think I keep my current superior acid nozzle. Don't see anything suspicious here. Just one lever. Okay. And we are back to the main room. One is closed, one is still open. So we'll go now this way. And We will still need to find some more Only one way. Let's check a little bit around first before moving that this is only one way as well. And we will need one more. Hmm.
Nothing here. Too many. Too many places to check, but looks like no hidden buttons for me. I'm pretty long in this level and still no secret found. It's not nice. Shite. And I'm I was almost destroyed, but let's see. Fuck. Too late. Okay, let's get this fast. But let's get here first. Or not, no. Let's go back to the place where I was before. life again or in this game for integrity Missed. Yep, everything cleared. And now don't forget to save before.
We got some time to check. This out and nothing there. This needs to be some hidden button anywhere. Oh shit. Let's do one more. <laughs> one more death. No clue. Let's go. Okay, this was fast. <laughs> Newfound joy. Hey, friend, remember my last letter? Going on about how boring life was here. Well, you can just forget about it. We're working on a new exciting experiment led by Laura Reich. She's amazing, and I must say, I really... I've finally found my place in the tower. Won't be able to meet uh, you at lunch anytime soon, you know. Buried under all the test tubes and papers and tasks. Ha uh ha. -huh. Jane Shane, substance field assistance. So, we have all of his notes. Uh, let's see. Steel sword. Here is a button. Let's see what it opened. This. Yay, so I found out the way to this <laughs> chest. Let's check. Sorry. Hey Jane, sorry to hear about your hardships. Hardly found a spare minute to write you back. Been doing double shifts for like forever. Now time for myself or my dear ones. This is the second time uh, we've had to replace the fuel pumps already. Not piece by piece, but the whole technology. First diesel instead of steam, now fumium instead of diesel. If you ask me, diesel was perfectly okay and we could have stayed on that just fine. A few of my men got exposed to the new substance and I had and had to be sent to the infirmary. Never seen burns so strange. 
Anyway, sorry for the rant. Sadly, I won't make it to the canteen tomorrow. Maybe next week? Peter Rollins, fueling unit. Okay, this is a switcher. Switch your position with an enemy in front of you. So, okay, I will probably have to start throwing away the purple items. Repeater, a unique one hand handgun weapon. 60 damage and instant reload. Much better. We'll see if the switch will be useful or not. Anyway, mm, that was a uh, first secret out of two. Let's see if we can get anywhere else. Ah, shit. And the level up. Just in time. Uh, as I said, this one is best for me at the moment. More resistance, less damage. Revolt. The fools revolted. It began within my own team of underlings and quickly spread to the common workers. They accuse me of people disappearances, that I neglect safety and push them to the limit in taking grave risks. Useless worms. They have no idea that some of them have already become a part of my secret experiment, one not even Marcus knows about. At the gathering, even James Kroll, the prodigy kid and loyal follower of my endeavors, questioned me. Questioned me, Laura White. What nerve! And then he pointed at my Fenium amplifier headset, accusing the substance of having infected me. All of a sudden, this uncontrollable primal anger took a hold of me. I lashed out at him and struck him with a discharge. The kid just collapsed to the ground with his eyes gouged out and his brain leaking out of his ears. And then I blacked out. I just can't believe what was happening during my absence. Why would Laura do such things? At least the state the tower's in is starting to make sense now. Mm-hmm. Shotgun. And... Everybody are more... Yep. I will be doing this slowly. Really no need to use that if I have something much better. Well, with Dalma. 
Uh, this might be useful or not, but 64, 68, 33, too much stuff carried around. Okay, let's save and let's move forward. There, here I am. More plates are up now. So I was not visiting this place yet. So save and let's see what we will have here. Okay, having all that spells and skills have uh, one big advantage of not needing to dutch so much. Time has come. Marcus has sailed away to the Bureau of Citadel. Supposedly to answer for how he lost control over me in the tower. To provide explanations and defend me from prosecution for neglecting protocol. Marcus is a coward. A scared fool. A short-sighted lackey to the Bureau who can't understand the importance of freedom in my research projects. Same goes for all the fools who've been rebelling against me since his departure, unwilling to continue the experiments. Who cares? Now that Marcus is away, my real research shall commence, whether anyone likes it or not. I don't understand how she could have grown so distant from me. I just can't believe the change was natural. There must have been something sinister behind it all. Okay, one more doors. And probably another trap set up for me. So maybe I will need to sixty four, sixty eight. 
Okay, so... No? The hell? This one, maybe? This one? New boots. We'll see. Advanced zapper. Basic goes there. <laughs> No hidden stuff. Well, I somehow need to find a way how to kill more than two enemies at once for an achievement. But yeah, let's check just in case these two both. Sides of the room for the buttons. Oh, looks like nothing. Let's go. So it's time to go through here. But here was. I will check this a little bit later because there was some place where might be something hidden. Is it secret or not? 
or was it just to show what does the sink do and to be cautious later well no never mind let's get back to exploring the area in a place where I was not yet Oh. This will take a little bit while because gadgets do not work on it. And it's done. And <laughs> yes, the second secret. What a lucky find. Let's use this for a while and more experience so no need to run around and searching for another secrets this is done in this level let's save it and follow the corridors no doesn't help So, take this first, superior M stabilizer, fumium power. Hey babe, glad to hear you're doing just fine now. See, though you were overreacting, you know, everything was so new to you, the work, the people. We've finished replacing the whole fueling core with fumium propellants and I have to take back what I said about it earlier. Sure, it's a little more tricky to get around fumium without compromising your health, but the dumb thing outputs over 10 times more than 
was ever possible with a leading edge combustion in giants. This could be a game changer for the world. So no time to meet at the mo. Just let me know when you have a minute and we can go grab a beer. Peter Holland's fueling unit. Okay, another complete. Massacre. When I came round back to myself, I saw it. The massacre. It seemed that within a few hours, everybody in the tower had either been eradicated or fled to the sea. But even they were doomed in the inhospitable waters of Nave Corum. I feel so responsible for them. I didn't... I didn't really want this. But I can't control the fury that burns within me. My combat fumatons killed everybody. What happened to me? Mindlessly, as if led by something beyond me, I put the dead bodies that stayed in a more or less intact state into Thunian solution tanks and ordered the fumatons to clear out the tower of any further remains. Oh my god, woman, what did you do? Is that the devil inside you or is it Thumium? Okay, so... This will probably be to just save it and... Let's throw the war hammer. Nope. Nope. Hmm. Okay. Maybe this is what is needed for this job. Switcher number four. No? But, yeah. <laughs> no switcher. It was just... You need to click the lever device. No other place to go, so let's see. Fuck. A oh, flamethrower guy, shit.
and the fight is done. Uh, bronze. Key. A little bit chaotic, but we are alive. Let's see here first. Oh, uh, nope. Is this no place to go? Well, okay. That's it then. Two out of two secrets found, and this will be it for now, for today. And yes, again, thanks a lot for being here with me. If you liked my blind playthrough feel free to follow me on twitch and mixer for more streams from the vaporum and maybe other games mainly indies or subscribe to my youtube channels thanks a lot for being here again and enjoy the rest of your day see you soon